Um, I'm still running into problems here. As you can see, the uh, crank arm that I've put in, I think I've put it in correctly, uh, seems to work. The other side seems to work perfectly. There's no clearance. It's actually hitting on the guard. Whether or not, um, if I remove the guard which kind of was really nice as a kind of retention system I suppose and also take care of my feet uh, whether it will clear is in another question um, let's go all the, all the way back through and you can see how much it's not clearing from here uh, let's just move it like this so you can get a better look from the side so I've got the option of maybe grinding the crap out of my cranks which I suppose is strong enough and shave them to pass. It's kind of a shame to remove this. It might fit. It does look like there's a little bit of a bend outwards. I don't know if it looks like that to you but it kind of looks like it bends outwards. There really is no space for a guard with the primary as you can see I think the best would be if there was more Q-factor or if the crank was a hell of a lot shorter since most people aren't going to be pedaling very much at all now maybe we should try that again from the other side I'll have to put this down for a second just bear with me while I pick up the bike Fuck, what am I doing wrong here? Oh, that's right, the fucking light's there. <laughs> oh, that doesn't help, does it? Doesn't help at all, fuck. Just let me spin it. Okay, so we're back to the starting point. So it's easy to record. And on the other side, a bit darker on this side now that I don't have the light. That's why the light was here. So what have we got? Let's have a look at the line. How much space is there in there? If this was um, offline, but to me it looks uh, as pretty much as it's going to line up as you can get it. Um, so basically, this crank. Let's, let's roll it forward. Let's see how much it clears. Yeah. So yeah, there's a good space there. I would say that's a uh, a nice space. I don't know if you if you if you moved a few mil in from this side uh, uh, toward this side. If I sort of twisted the whole frame, which I don't really think is a good idea. Um, it looks kind of like a uh, a good size basically so yeah have been having issues with the sizes I didn't want this this size chain ring I, I wanted 32 I got this one instead but uh, apart from that I thought I'd give it a go and unfortunately there's this um, extra issue happening now so stay tuned I will see if this fits without the guide this um, bolt or whatever you call it looks like it might just pass